you know, she's older, she's smarter, she's getting to know the world, but she's also like very innocent. And I think that she, you still see glimpse of her letting go and just like doing her thing. You know what I'm saying? And just like jumping out and dancing and singing and being Stargirl. I really love that Stargirl is given more dimension, emotional dimension in this film. You get to see her have a lot more um, different relationships with people, not just romantic. I think that he's genuinely interested in her words and what she has to say, which I really like for Stargirl because I think because of who she is, you know, she's girly, but she's also, you know, quirky and, and has all these things to say. It's She's very susceptible to becoming just a, a spectacle to watch. So I love that for her. Stargirl genuinely dreams. Like, point blank period, genuinely, wholeheartedly dreams, which I feel like is rare to see these days. Like people who literally just dream without any, without any like, oh, well then there's this and then there's that and I'm not good enough and this is why I can never do that. This is all the things I would do if I were a different person. Stargirl doesn't do that. She's just like, this is what I'm gonna do. This is what I wanna do. I think a lot of people get disappointed over the outcomes of things just because it wasn't exactly what they fantasized about or planned about, but I think that it's most important to just know that your dream can be absolutely whatever the universe makes it to be.